Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I just got finished having another tutorial from Kathy to teach uh, teach me how to use the software so I can share videos with you in a better way. So now hopefully you can see me and what we're talking about. And if you haven't heard of this yet, well, it is kind of shocking news, but not anything we haven't been expecting, right? <clears throat> Maybe perhaps we'd hoped it'd been farther down the road, but things also are not always what they seem. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and play this and let you hear it. This is Tuesday, August the 17th, 2021, and we have some urgent news here. This is a very critical update that a uh, U.S. declaring war on China experts shocked as U.S. Senator reveals 30,000 American troops are now in Taiwan. So this is breaking news. You're probably not going to hear it on any other channel. Maybe you will. But uh, if this is true, folks, we have 30,000 American troops in Taiwan. The Chinese are saying if this is true, they're going to war with the United States. So uh, I, I told you, folks, that uh, they've got to have some kind of war to weaken the United States in order to impose their new world order and force people to take the mark of the beast. So I think a war with China is coming up very, very soon and with Russia. And this is just going to give the Chinese another excuse just to go ahead and try to take Taiwan. But let's go ahead and read this. This is from Sputnik News. A U.S. A senior U.S. Senator, also member of the U.S. Senate Select Committee on Intelligence, on his social media revealed that the United States has 30,000 soldiers stationed uh, in Taiwan's island. Chinese experts say if this is true, it is a military invasion and the occupation of Taiwan and is equivalent to the United States declaring war on China. Okay, I'm going to uh, stop it right there. That's just a minute and a half of it, and it's only 3 minutes and 50 seconds, so you might want to listen to the rest of it and realize uh, war is coming but we are not to fear the the barley harvest or the first fruits we will not be harmed god will not have brought us along this far just to let us get you know invaded and blown up or killed or whatever and what he said about they need to have a war to bring along to mandate the you know what um it kind of seems like that's happening anyway so take it for what it is it's a report it's uh, a possibility so if you have loved ones in the service which unfortunately they're all being mandated and forced to take it as well but um I just hope we're out of here before any war uh, hits. If the tweet Oops. is correct, Sorry. China could immediately activate could. the anti-succession law to destroy oh. uh, and expel. Okay, now I don't know what... Um, that's that part I didn't... Um, apparently they have a mandate that they will stay out of there, if we'll stay out of there, and... I don't understand all the politics involved, but I'm sure a lot of you do. So, with my first little trial, well, it's actually my second video, I'm going to uh, close out now and say I plead the blood of Jesus over this video and over everybody who has not yet, um, well, I'm not sure how to say that on YouTube, but uh, I plead the blood over all of our devices and our internet connections and I pray that I keep learning more and more easily how to use this so I'm now going to hit and I continue to pray for